What is up, everybody? It's me, Stephanie, your independent sensei consultant. Um, sorry, wiping my eyes off. Um, if you notice my nose is red, please don't mind as blemish. It's acne. Um, we're going to be talking about a new collection down below, and I will be posting pictures in the video as well. Um, if you did not see the last video, I started some new editing, so yay. I'm very happy and pleased with myself, so I couldn't be even more happier. Um, so the collection that we're going to be talking about today is um, Scent of the Season Wax Collection. So I do have one of these bars, but, well actually I used to have two of these bars, um, but my grandma bought it a long time ago. So I decided that I am going to purchase this collection here soon, um, whenever it is free to do so. Um, also, <clears throat> we're going to be talking about um, the wax collections. We're also going to talk about um some empties that i went through and my reviews on it also i am going to smell the wax of friends with you as well also i'm going to show you the warmer of the boots lit up because i forgot in the last video that i said i was going to show it and yesterday when after i just got this this broke um, you probably look at it and like stuff what's broke on it. There is a little bracket that's like this has broken off here. Does it still work? Yeah, it still works. But it might be loose. So there's the boots. I will light it up. Um, it is a little loose. So what I might do is contact Sensi and ask him if they can send me a black, um, wall plug for the boots because it broke it was by mistake it was not on purpose i accidentally broke it if not if they can't do it that's fine because i got spare ones in the shed um so if you guys don't know um sometimes i take my wax out in the shed because it gets a lot colder than in the house because i have a wood stove i don't have what you say ac which is a furnace or anything in the house so we have to rely on wood burners and we have to use fans during the summertime and an ac unit like what you stick in a window that's it um so so all the bars i have that are either retired or discontinued and not coming back i'm taking them out to the shed and where it's going to stay cold for the next four months. And then when it gets hot out there, I'll probably bring them inside and keep them cold. Um, also, if you are new to Sensi, hi and welcome. This is a Sensi channel where we talk about Sensi contents, where collections, Sensi club, Whiffer box. Um, if you hear a lot about Whiffer Box or Sensi Club, just take it as a friendly reminder that um, you can add these certain products to your Sensi Club. So let's go ahead and dive into this video real quick. I'm going to pop up the news tab onto my computer and I'm just going to read straight from the computer of what Sensi says. It says, Joy 2 new and 3 returning fragrance. So... The three that are returning is eggnog, uh, toasted apple butter, and meant to be merry. And the two new ones is cheer cherry, cherry, like cheer, like being cheered, cherry, cherry, and merry wonderland. So I will tell you what they look like. So I'm gonna go like this. And put the Scentsy bar there in the picture and hold it up for you and talk about the Scentsy bar. So the first one, the very new one, is Cherry Cherry, a light heart candy cherry, spice amber with a wink of smoked marshmallow and blackberry. 
And then the next one is eggnog. Eggnog is a warm spice tan of nutmeg, rum, and cream. The scent is a real holiday fragrance. A new one is uh, Merry Wonderland is a pink apple clover dash through a dream sprinkling spruce of woodland. The returning of Meant to be Merry is a mere um, merriment full the, in the sky when crushed candy canes and sprinkled sugar brings a creamy butter cookie and toasted almond toasted apple butter is a creamy butter blend with a ripped apple ascended ascent with a rich spice so with all these scentsy bars that are in the scent to be merry they will be available for november 1st 12 01 a.m pacific timing so if you're not familiar with your timing and easter timing it is 301 central is 201 mountain is 101 and pacific is 1201 a.m so there's that also i would like to show you some of the empties i went through two of them are in the catalog and two uh, one of them is not so these excuse me these two are in the catalog and this one's not so let's go ahead and do some reviews on the empties so for pumpkin roll if you guys don't know me, pumpkin roll is my go-to for the holidays. Soon as fall starts, I throw pumpkin roll in my warmer and warm it. Right now, I got, um, war what I'm warming right now is, um, oh, polar bear hug. It started off with a nice romantic smell. I warmed it for... Oh, I've been warming it for two whole days, and it still smells beautiful, romantic. It's not um, heavy. It's light. So if you're into light fragrance, I say get Polar Bear Hug because Polar Bear Hug is not, like, in your face right there. It's, like, a soft settling. Um, so, like, when I leave and come back from, leave my room and come back, I still get the smell of the Polar Bear Hug. Pumpkin roll. Soon as I throw a pumpkin roll into my warmer, I smell it all the time. It's a beautiful, nice pumpkin roll scent. It smells like pumpkin roll. It's a true pumpkin roll scent. I love it. I wish it was a scentsy brick so I can get my hands on it again. Um, when they had it as a scentsy brick, let me tell you, I would have saved it. But pumpkin roll, my rating is a yes for me. So my rating from 1 to 10, this is a 10 for me, is pumpkin roll. Next one is mocha doodle. Me and my mother-in-law, we love mocha doodle. We love coffee scented stuff. Um, sorry if you see a little bit of wax on there. I got a little bit messy. But, um... I love the heavy cream that's in there, the chocolate, the coffee blend. It's just very nice. Um, my grandpa, he loved this fragrance. He loved it. Um, unfortunately, um, he passed away. And I don't want to bring that up. But, but this is pumpkin roll. Or not pumpkin roll. <sighs> Mugga doodle. I couldn't read for a minute. But this is Mugga doodle. My rating for this is 9 out of 10 for me. I love the Mugga doodle by itself. But you can also mix this with something to make it a little bit better if you want. Alright. The one that's not in the catalog, which is sad for me. This one to me is like a true fall scent. I'm not sure why they went away with it, but hear me out. 
I love this scent. Love it very much. Wish it will come back. Hopefully it does come back. But I went to a um, zucchini fest in September. And I got it again as a Scentsy Bar. Like a full Scentsy Bar. I couldn't go without it. And it is called Bright Cider Life. Bright Side of Life has that pumpkin, apple, and cinnamon spice. And it gives me like that true fall and I love it. And I still get the fragrance in the clam shell even though it's empty. I do miss this scent a lot. I do have another Scentsy Bar of it. I am holding tight to it because it's no longer with us. So unfortunately it will be with me for a while until Scentsy decides to bring it back. Nothing negative towards Scentsy or nothing. I understand um, we have to try out new things. You have to get rid of the old to try out some new things, which I understand. Not like get rid of it permanently, but just like, you know, allow new fragrance to come. Um, next one is Friends. So Friends Collection is out as we're speaking. Um, probably the time I end this video, it could be, there could be a chance that it could be gone. But, who am I to say that if it's gone? So, let me check for sure if it is still available as so. So, this is still available. And, I think I have read this to you. But, I have the Scentsy Bar right here. And, this is what it looks like on the packaging. I hope when they do Friends again... I hope that they do the taxi in a warmer. Imagine if they would have done the taxi in a warmer, like an element warmer. That would be cool. Because they got the couch in a um, darling decor and they got the couch as a warmer. I just really hope that they would make friends the taxi in the movie or in the TV show come as a warmer i would love to see it as a warmer but i have a full bar <clears throat> of friends now the time when it first came out i didn't get a chance to get the bar so i do got another consultant's name there which i'm not putting it out there because i do believe they got their own channel and their own stuff um, it looks kind of sweaty and a little gross because it got a little sweaty. So this is why I stick my Scentsy Bars outside when I have a wood stove going on because it causes this. But nothing bad. So this is a double shot espresso. Fresh brewed coffee creates the best coffee house mood where moments with friends are sweetened by laughter and coconut cream. I do get the double shot of espresso and that coffee and a little bit of that coconut uh, cream. The coconut cream is like, it feels like it's on the top layer. You know when you're drinking a cup of coffee, the coffee is down below and the cream is on top. This is what I'm getting. Still have a full bar. Haven't warmed it yet. I'm going to think about warming it, but I haven't got to it yet. So, there's that. I do have... The warmer right here i am going to lit it up for you hopefully it doesn't fall apart on me while i'm trying to plug it into the wall all right so i got it plugged in and this is what i'm going to do is i'm going to turn it over like this real quick and then i'm going to like it on so this is what it looks like and there you go all right oh sorry i just kind of gave you guys like a sickness motion for a minute but that's all what I have for you today. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. If you have any questions, uh, my website will be here. If you like to know where the website is. Also, down below, say thank you for watching.
and it was a like and comment as well so you guys have yourself a great day be safe out there i'll see you guys in the next video plus we might do a sniff session here soon i'm almost done with all my assignments so be on the lookout for another sniff session love you all see you guys in the next one bye bye